So I've made a new account here to try to see how many achievements I could get in the span of one hour. It's one of my older accounts, as you can see by the outdated name. Now, this account did play the tutorial, so it'll be more like how many achievements I can get in the span of an hour, rather than from, rather than from starting from, you know, from scratch the tutorial. Now, to aid myself in trying to figure out, uh, to optimize the amount of achievements I need to get in this game, I have made a spreadsheet of all the achievements I believe are feasible to get on a new account in one hour. And out of the 144, I have uh, whittled it down to approximately 61 achievements. Also, the achievement rate is shown, just for your reference. Now, before I even begin here, I've already unlocked one achievement, which is just create a Niji Q account, so I will just go ahead and bold to show that I've completed that one. I also spent a little bit of time writing out some quick notes of what game modes I should play, or what the strategy is going to be. So let's just go over it real quickly. There's an achievement for beginner, intermediate, and advanced. So I want to play at least one of each. I want to do Candy Falls for the secret achievements. And I want to unlock the Falling Towers because this week's race can be done under three minutes, which I get three achievements for. And at some point, I'm going to be playing four player co-op because there's so many achievements to unlock in co-op. So I will say timer starts once I press collect on this first achievement. Three, two, one, begin. So let's get this. And the Insta, and let's start with an easy map, also. Like 50 Mikey Money. I'll do, uh, right, Candy Balls. Easy mode. Just like the other one hour run, I will not use any, uh, well, cheats, as in IAPs, uh, mods, uh, to speed up the game. I can already knock off Hero Time off the list, because that's Deploy Hero on a known tutorial map. I also should be anti-stalling, so I need to pop the balloons as quickly as I can here. So right, the secret, secret achievement is uh, for the golden ticket achievements. So I need to click things on this map in a certain order. So let's do it. One. Eh, two. Three. I don't know how f if I have to slow this down. But I'm going to try to fast forward just to ensure that I get the achievements. Okay, I'm just going to double check if I have the achievements real quick. Yep, I got the achievement, so that's good. Yeah, there's usually an audio cue for if you got the achievement or not, but I had it on really low volume. So I just had to 10 seconds to back out and just double check. And sure, I got the achievements. So reminder, I'm rushing the uh, upgrades that I need to get race towers for. So that would be Cluster Bomb into Recursive. I also do need a Spike Bolt, so let's unlock this, this, and this. Also, make sure to use level 3 Quincy. That's an achievement right there. Level 3 ability. So gold tickets all the way down here, 9.6% of people, only 10% of players have gone that one, which might be a bit surprising. All right, let's unlock cluster bombs. Maybe I should have played a couple more rounds for this one, because I'm not really going to get many unlocks for 40 rounds. I'll make sure to do that for the intermediate map I play. I don't really want to double dip on the um, beginner maps, you know. All right, we also got spike ball unlock, awesome. Now I don't need to level the dark monkey anymore. All right, level eight. Let's unlock Monkey Ace because I said I wanted a four two zero for that one. It's also important to kind of wait for a week, a race week, where the time to get under three minutes is very fast. Luckily, this one is. We'll, we'll see in a second. Yeah, I'm not even gonna get down to the Magic Towers for this forty rounder. So I'm thinking my next one should be intermediate hard mode. Let's make this more quickly. There we go. That was a pretty decently quick, easy map. And let's also unlock achievements, because I get monkey money along the way. This could be useful for other achievements that I'll need more of that for, so let's see. I'm going to change my hero also. Oh crap, can't. That's not good. So for uh, intermediate, I'm going to unlock Spice Islands. I also didn't get level 14 to change my hero, which is bad, because there was an achievement where I could... Uh, if I use four different heroes for four different games, unfortunately, I might need to do five games for that, but I don't know if that's feasible or not. Yeah, right here. Monkey Avenger League is what I was looking for. Maybe we can squeeze in time for like an easy map. An extra easy map. But that's already not really a great start. The reason why I'm doing Spice Islands hard is also because I can unlock uh, Spice Islands APR. Which allows me to get the So Spicy achievement, which is literally the lowest thing on the list here. 1.7%. So it's just APR with only land towers, which I feel like isn't that hard. Assuming I unlock the Ninja and the Alchemist, just... Decent early game for land towers. I also have enough for a recursive cluster, so that's awesome. We fully maxed up bomb tower, which means I should not drop any extra bombs at this point. 
All right, there's ODS. So I don't really need to buy more ace upgrades. I just need some for, I guess, mid game. And if I get all of badge towers, I'll definitely go for Alchemist. All right, there's 15, so quickly. This will be huge. This one compounding tech problem with getting XP and certain towers is that, like, I want to, I generally want to get the towers that I have upgrades for so that I can defend the mid game, which means I'm just getting even more XP on the towers I don't need XP for. Although there is an achievement for getting a uh, tier five monkey. I've already gotten this one up, by the way, Big Monkey. It has been deployed. So technically the ideal way to split XP would be just to uh, sell the towers, but I can't really do that right now. I just kind of need to drop as many base towers. All right, took 10 rounds to get through, that's fine. Now we get an up to every single damage tower. Level 17, Ninja. This will be great for ABR, so I definitely want to be leveling that too, but there's so many towers I'm splitting XP on right now. Pretty inefficient, can't lie. We also got level 10 Quincy, so I'm just gonna use the ability even though I don't need to right now. Just to check off that achievement to use a level 10 hero. Now there is also achievement to get 50 monkeys on the map at once. Tetramino, so I guess I'll do that right now. I wanna get XP and sub, or I guess a D camo. Well, I'm actually not gonna be able to use subs for ABR run because remember the achievements for land towers only, but this is fine. We also got stronger stim, so let's quickly unlock that. But that's pretty much all the Alp XP I need, so maybe I'll stop there. Yeah, yeah, I'm spending too much on Alchemist, guys. We also got some rich support now, so I'm free to defend all camos in this game. Oh crap, I almost died to 63. Okay, hang on. Hang on, hang on here. Oh crap. Oh, my first continue is free. Okay, thank god. Thank goodness for that. Uh, I'm lucky I didn't lose much time for that. I probably would have been able to like spend money on like one continue, though. Or two. I did get monkey money for achievements, but obviously uh, not ideal. Okay, I think with this amount of subs, I can freely cross off the uh, Tetramino. I am aware of this achievement here, spending 1k monkey money on continuous checkpoints, but I don't really want to. I don't really want to use that right now, though. Okay, we got D breath, which is what I want for the race. Let's go ahead and upgrade all these. And now I am looking for a ninja XP. Perhaps at the end of this game, I might just spend a bunch of money to get level 20 Quincy. Just so I can get that achievement out of the way. My first tier farm is unlocked. You know what? I'll just do Bomb Blitz. If I have $37,000 long around, I'll quickly get the uh, tier 5 achievement. In fact, I'll just check that off the list preemptively. Level 15 Quincy means I still gotta pump in a lot of money for for him. So maybe I'll do 1 to 2 round, rounds of free play, which isn't ideal for uh, XP reasons. ZMG here sure is taking a while. Come on. Hurry up and pop, will ya? Level 10 Quincy and GG. All right. So quickly, I will sell a bunch of these towers here to get Bomb Blitz. There we go, there's my tier 5 monkey. I don't know if I need to beat around here, but maybe I'll just, yeah, leave that to be safe. I also don't have enough money for level 20, unfortunately, so... Am I really sticking around this game for level 20 Quincy? Or do you think I should just do it in co-op? I think I might just do it in co-op. Yeah, yeah, Crap, well... We lost save in this run. That's fine. So now we got out level 24. Okay, let's quickly collect all the achievements here. So we did get the 50 monkey towers, and now I unlocked the race. So I want to jump into into that immediately. I've already practiced on this race a lot, so I already know how to beat it in three minutes or less. So it's Spike Bolt. You buy this, and then you send 16 rounds. Uh, you get a bomb on close. Oh crap! I already messed up. This is this is fine. The good thing about this race is that there is no knowledge. No knowledge naturally. And I choked, so never mind. I'll spend 100 monkey money. I forgot this at hotkeys. Normally I have my round send at a better hotkey, which is why I choked that run, unfortunately. Yeah, this is doing way worse than I thought. I'll just play this run a bit safe then. 20, ro 20 rounds. Heavy bombs. Uh, Crap. I need Ninja here to save, save me. Fine. 35. Alk. 39. Let's get recursive. And let's start sending a bunch of rounds now. 46. Let's get D-Breath back here. And now I just spam uh, Operation Dart Storm. This should be a sub two minutes if I uh, didn't mess this up. Yep, and we're getting XP really quickly because races give you that much. So maybe if I need a quick fix for XP, 
I'll go ahead and play the race. Crap, don't die, don't die. Don't die, holy crap, that was close. I almost choked that, I almost choked that. So fast forward, and sub three minutes. Piece of cake. And we got a new hero. Very nice. Alright, so, yep. Three achievements just like that. Nice and quick. So now I want to do ABR on Spice Islands. Also, let me unlock the... Uh, don't think, oh, right, I don't have enough. That's fine. So let's get the land-only achievements. So this is how much people do not play races. Look how low they are. Even the 10-minute one. Just 5% of people have played a race and have gotten under 10 minutes, which is pretty crazy to see. Meanwhile, me is level 20. Just get in a quick 2.5 minutes in 2 minutes. And it does look like the... Uh, the time is only there for this game and a quick co-op game. The next game we're going to do after this is an advanced map. I want to say a peninsula because the achievement where you get 200k pops on peninsula, which I think is very easy to achieve. So this is for the live viewers who are about to join. Have lots of cash drops ready on hand to give to me. Because you see there's so many achievements here where you just give money on co in co-op mode. So if you just like spam cash drops and then give the money to me and then I give it back. I can unlock a crazy amount of achievements. And now we're officially halfway through the challenge. Obviously, not a lot of achievements unlocked so far. If I look at the bolded, probably have like 12. But there's a lot of achievements I can easily get once I join the club game. Because like, uh, using instas, that's one of them. Spending monkey money. Basically saving a whole chunk of them for the last run. So uh, don't be alarmed so far if the uh, amount of achievements I have is pretty low. I also need XP for Blue Jitsu for round 40. If... I don't know if two double shot is enough. Yeah, frick, frick, frick. Come on, pop. Ah, oh, crap. You know what? I'm gonna use continue here. Let's hope this is not too bad. Like, I need to get the 1k monkey money for the uh, continue achievement anyways. Ah, uh, oh, crap. This sucks. This sucks, though. Alright, let's drop the... Uh, oh, crap. I'm dead again. Oh, this is so bad. This is so bad. I don't have any damage up here. Let's use this. And then let's sell... Uh, come on. Okay, I'm just losing a bunch of monkey money here. I have a lot to go through still. We knew this gym would be so hard. Alright, this should be fine. There we go. <sighs> All because I don't have Balloon Jitsu unlock. And now I get it this round. That's very unlucky. I feel like we're popping uh, BFBs too slowly. So let me do uh, an AC. Even though I don't need XP. I just need to use it to pop the mobs faster. Yeah, see it's 4 to 5 BFB. It's taking so long to pop. It's not good for uh, speedrun reasons. But with the land towers only, I, I literally can't put anything up here. Alright. Oh, crap. Uh, don't die, don't die. I forgot about... How did the Shimmer miss camos? That's crazy. If I recall correctly, I have 400 more monkey money spent to get the 1k monkey money achievement. I believe I spent like 600 for uh, around 40 this game. Yeah, yeah it sucks. I, I really... It's seems so long to kill the ZMG. We're now down to sub 10... 20 minutes. And let's fire. There we go. That was hellish. But we got a crap ton of uh, XP. Now before I do co-op, I need to make a challenge for level 20. Or play a challenge. Make a challenge and play a challenge. So I've already done the, uh, what do you call it? The answer for, oh crap, I don't have absolute zero. I don't, oh no, I don't have Power Lord either. Oh, I can't do the advantage. I don't have the upgrades. Never mind. Minus one achievement right there. All right, let's make a challenge. So let's just do one to one with nine 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 cash, and uh, do that real quick. And if I submit a challenge, I should get an achievement really quickly. There we go. Go home and press share, and I should get an achievement, right? Yes, sir. Okay, now let's do co-op. So I need to create a peninsula match. Let me unlock. I'll do 60 rounds because there's only 18 minutes left. Get in here. People with lots of money and XP. Okay, I think we're ready. Let's go. So guys, give me all your cash drops. I'm going to play. Use your cash drops. In fact, I'll use all them too. Or use my road spikes at least. There we go. Now huh? we're talking Wall Street. Yes, yes, yes. I'll spend all my powers. I think there's an achievement to get 10 powers used. That's not 10 powers, but I can buy powers with my monkey money. How much do I have, by the way? 1555. That's not bad. So yeah, let me uh, quickly uh, just buy a couple more powers from the shop. 
I think there's a achievement where you have one of every power, if I remember this correctly. So let me see if I can at least buy one of each one. Make sure to have 400 monkey money too for the continue at the end. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Yeah, collect at least 12 different powers. This is the one right here. So we can cross that off. And also, thank you guys for giving me a bunch of money. Now I'll send a bunch of it. So that instantly gets me 10k, 50k, and 100k. And we're going to be at one map in four player co-op mode. So I'll cross that off too. Also, make sure to drop all your heroes down. Because you have to, I think, place your heroes down to get all four heroes at once. The collaborate over here. Now I'm waiting for the rest. Also, there was one achievement to uh, emote 100 times, so I, I apologize, guys. You can mute me, but I must keep spamming this. Social Butterfly is uh, 100 emotes in one game. I'm just going to play it safe, so I might go over 100 here. But thank you guys for doing the Chinook for me. And we're trying to get 1,000 lives here as quickly as possible. Also, we need 2.5 million to get Bill Grates, right? Where is it? Yeah, send 500k to an ally and co-op in one go, so... If you guys have more cash drops, then... I don't mind. Actually, I'll give you guys some money. Because, again, I don't have the farm unlocks. I'll give them back so they can keep farming. Use five insta-monkeys in co-op mode. Okay! I, so I, I, I hate this. I have four insta-monkeys. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, and also, invigoration. How do, how do we get 75 buffs active on monkeys at once here? I don't know how it works in co-op mode. Like... If, it, if anyone else has jungle drums or just gives the buffs, does it also count for me for the GM? Because if it does, then that'd be nice. Otherwise, I'm just gonna personally spam a bunch of alpha buffs. If it doesn't work for other people, someone should just buy a homeland order called arms and then use the ability. Because at this point, we have, I think we have more than enough towers to activate the, the buff. So uh, there's power user. Use powers 25 times. I forgot how much I used it uh, already. But I think if I want to get that achievement, I should just use Road Spikes, right? Because they give you five in a stack. I also have to back out a minute before the game ends, because I forgot to use the uh, Monkey Knowledge Point, which is another achievement. So basically, one minute to go back and just get a bunch of things. Also, I need level 20 uh, a hero. Do I have enough money to just get struck at level 20 right now? Nice. Okay. So I'll finally knock off Epic Hero. 10 minutes left on round 3 4. Can we beat 26 rounds in 9 minutes? Hopefully. So we should start selling towers at some point. So we got 1,000 lives. I'll cross that off. I don't know if I can pop 200,000 balloons on Peninsula. I don't know if there's 200k for 60 rounds here. Uh, Timo, could you send back your 500k? Because I need to get Monkey Philanthropist. I don't know if I have that achievement yet. There's also one for Big Spender, right? Yeah, spend 100k cash or a million in one round. So here's what I'll do. I'll wait for a very long round. We should also start, uh, what do you call it? Selling some towers, because it, it's it's really slow now, it feels like. So here's how I'll get a million dollars spent in one round. You just buy level 20 striker and keep on selling it. If the game allows you to, because it's so laggy right now, before this ends. Maybe I should have done this on, like, round 48, because I can't guarantee I'll get all this in time. Come on. I think I got a million dollars in one round, though. That's, like, a lot of money spent. Also, we'll make sure to send a bunch of money back for a million dollars. And, okay, yeah, let's start selling towers, guys. It's too, it's too slow. I don't know if I can finish this game in five minutes. It's gonna be a race against time for me to back out of the game. And then, you know, spend the monkey knowledge and do everything else. Like, spend the monkey money and continues. Oh, no, this is close. This is close. I think we can do it. It might just be exactly the one minute I have left. There should be a quick round 60 kill too with the Sky Shredder, Bomb Blitz, and Perm Brew. Anytime now. Thank you for the Pirate Lord. And nice. Okay. Let's go home. Minute 20 left, so let's just collect everything quickly. I believe there's a there's a trophy reward, so there's also a achievement where I can spend something on the trophy store. So I need to find that after I get these achievements. All right, under one minute, so quickly. Let's spend Monkey Knowledge. I only have six, so I can't get the 10 achievement, so just one. Trophy, I'll buy the cheapest one. Epic, and I will go to the ABR game here to die. And and spend Monkey Money and continue, so quickly. 
Quickly. Alright. Sell. Just die, please. Nice. And this should get me to 1k exactly, so let's go back now. And I should have a lot more. Yep, three more. And I think that's it. With 15 seconds to spare, I believe that's all I could get. And it pisses me off that I'm so close to getting this achievement here. Wait, I didn't get level 20? Wait, what? 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 Whoa, whoa, whoa. How? I got level 20 striker. This is rigged. Well, time's up. Time's up, though. I gotta stop it there. Like, you saw it with your very eyes there. Yeah, maybe it doesn't come call. That's weird. But either way, if it did count, I would have gotten two more achievements. Because I was one achievement off, guys. From achievement of achievements. So that would end up being uh, 36. 36 in one hour. So approximately one every under two minutes. Gotta say, not bad for... Fresh counts. Oh, I also just realized I could have done that. Another achievement. I didn't know that you could unlock reverse immediately in co-op. So that would have been another one right there. I forgot to unlock upgrades for the advanced challenge too. So that could have been another another achievement if the advanced challenge was easy enough. So pretty close. I'd say I got pretty close to the optimal achievements in one, one hour here.